Hello, and welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, it may look as though I'm crying. I am not crying. You can't call me a crybaby. Oh, God, it's actually, that's bad. I lit, I just, as I, I had a big sneeze. You didn't want to see it. It was a, one of those big atus, and it just, like, popped my eyes. I was like, oh, my God. Uh, it's like the, the sneeze your dad used to make. You know, that le just obnoxiously loud. You you know what I'm saying. Um, so, yeah, let's see what we got here. I'm already excited because you've got some Point Luna game potentials with some cartel. Mm -hmm. um, but it's not perfect. It's not perfect. We need to draw some more cards because what we have to grab here isn't actually great. Like, there's basically just Luna and cartel. Um... Oh, gee, this is, it's actually not great. What was the other one, though? Mining Guild. I think we recently played Mining Guild, but awkwardly enough, this would be a great start. Two placements here, and then you also have Protected Valley, which uses all that steel, and you've got another placement here. So, like, very, um, very powerful start for Mining Guild, but I just haven't played Point Luna in forever, and I would really like to play Point Luna, especially with Cartel in the hand, right? you got to try. Uh, we'll just try and dig the deck, like, real aggressive, like, um, and we'll grab the points per Jovian, because you never know. Five cards, okay. Don't forget that we have an Earth Tag as Point Luna, so we did get to draw, or we should get to draw a card. Let's go ahead and do this. I should have actually done Wasa first, grab my Space Tags, uh, because then I may have known if I wanted to grab a little bit more Titanium to start the game. Uh, fantastic cards. And I got Electro Catapult as one of my cards. Very, very cool. Um, I don't have any steel production, though, which is a little bit tricky. This is an Earth Tag, though, so we got to remember that. Jeez, I wonder if it's worth buying Space Elevator just for the income. I doubt that's true. Uh, let's get uh, Vesta. And then... Honestly, I am going to grab Olympus Conference just to see what card draw gets me. Because it's something I want. Um, restricted area. I mean, more science is good. Uh, and then I think we do Radchem Factory just for the income. I could play... Um, there's a couple of different things I could have played there, but... I think that getting just a little bit of base income, holding on to Cartel for a hot minute here, while we see if we can get another Earth Tag, would be uh, great. Oh, man. I don't have the energy for this because AI Central is amazing and Equatorial Magnetizer can do amazing work um, to keep us afloat in this game. I only have two Earth Tags, so I'm still going to have to play Cartel here. We need to keep moving. We're kind of having a little bit of a stall out here. Um, and I'd really prefer to, to get a move on. We have some good opportunities for cards in our hand. The problem is that we don't have steel income. Uh, major problem for us right now. And we also need... Um, well, we wanted more earth cards, but what can you do? Oh, man. These are like, they're all, these are, like too good to pass up. It's, it's really tough on me right now. I need steel... I need energy. Those are the two things. I, I, I kind of failed to finish my sentence just now, but that's what I was trying to say. We're going to do this. We're definitely going to grab two more Jovians. So we are insanely good on Jovians right now. Uh, lots of points per Jovians floating around. Lots of opportunity. Uh, let's go ahead and play this bad boy as well. We're just pushing the envelope of uh, drawing cards here. We got an extra card because of Olympus Conference, which is every two science tags gives us something. Lots of high end game points cards, but like, honestly, which it's not that great for us. Yikes. Um, I do have one energy tag, so with a second energy tag, we can play Power Supply Consortium. I'm going to wait another turn. This is like... I have so many great cards in my hand, but I don't have any income cards, which means that our engine isn't going to spool up fast enough to uh, be able to afford playing all of these cards. 
Finally, some energy. That's going to go a long way. Again, though, I have no steel production. So something like space elevators kind of just uh, a sad card for me. Though, you know what? It might be worth restricted area to go and scoop up some steel. I have six titanium. How how cheap are you? Nine bucks. Okay, that means I can do everything I want to do. I'm going to go here, grab some steel. It gets us a halfway to the next thing. We're now at two science tags, which is great. We go here. We spend all of our titanium and none of our steel. Because, again, we need steel. We don't have steel income. We sell a steel. That's good. Um... I don't have enough to get the deep well heating, but I do have enough to buy a card and still get power plant. And I think getting power plant is something that I know I want to do, so we may as well do it now. Again, not spending that steel uh, and letting that convert into um, into heat slowly. We're really not uh, terraforming the planet right now, but we have multiple avenues for generating TR over the course of the game. So kind of just need to I don't want to say we need to get lucky but we need something we'll take these events to get uh, to get some I don't even know like I almost want to use the ocean to get uh, more steel because we kind of need it uh, titanium mines great all that stuff is great I love like space event stuff I guess what I could do is play the subterranean reservoir and we'll go grab some titanium with that Okay, we like that. Then we take the titanium and we use it all up and we get the steel. And then that actually leaves me enough. I'm going to still check what card I got to not only get the titanium mine. Oh, I already bought a card. Perfect. And we got Lake Marineris. Like that's um, it's a pretty potent card to be honest. So now we have a little bit more TR and we have four titanium production, which is great. But everything in my hand is a building tag, <laughs> not a space tag. So we're really struggling to use our metals. And I don't want to use the metals I do have because I can convert them for $5 if I just uh, if I go another way about it. Uh, carbonate processing is going to be very powerful for us because we need to get that heat moving. And Arctic algae might be worth playing despite having already played three oceans. I think it will be. Again, I have tons of cards in my hands. I really need to avoid getting swamped with this many cards. But, you know, gotta gotta play the game, man. Oh, finally, Space Hotels. It's not like I knew Space Hotels was coming, but four income Earth tag? Come on. Like, that's what I was hoping for with Wausau. There's a Comet, which is great. Um, I want to play Carbonate Processing. Again, not spending the steel. I want to play your boy Deep Well Heating. And if I had enough, I would have also liked to have played uh, Power Consortium. But that's too bad. One thing that's great, though, is if we do need more power, which we will, Great Dam is available. And Great Dam can be played once I play Comet. So stay tuned for that, especially because I have eight heat or 10 heat but at least eight heat so with a comet that'll get us the next heat production for free it's gen 7 so it's pretty late to be leaning into that but you gotta do what you gotta do how many science types do i have I only played two it feels like i'm playing a science build and yet i don't have any science played so i am gonna grab search for life just in case i need one and i'm grabbing tectonic stress power because clearly i do need the um i need the energy and what we're going to actually do is start shredding that energy to become uh, TR, like literally as fast as possible. That's the that's the plan. Um, oh, God, but if I'm going to place an ocean, I need Arctic algae down. It sucks, but it has to be done. Has to be done. And then Comet. Hmm. I think that we're kind of starving for cash right now. 
But that comet gets us a whole bunch of plants back. It got us that heat production, which is what made it worth playing, quite frankly. Um, and I will spend five bucks to get another uh, energy production here. Next turn is going to have to be the turn where we start shredding energy for uh, TR right here, Equatorial Magnetizer. And then we'll be able to play Great Dam and Tectonic Stress Power as required. But that'll go a long way. I mean, like, we're not really terraforming the planet, so we, we need that help. And the energy going into heat is the other massive benefit that we have here. We will, of course, take a space event. We might take... Methane from Titan. I can't. I don't think I can. I have so many Jovians. Like, I have points per Jovian here. I have TR per Jovian. I got Jovian, 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 Jovian. But I, I can't afford them. I'll never afford methane from Titan. Maybe I'm wrong. And, you know, I'd love to be wrong. But I have a sinking suspicion that I'm right. And that's uh, that's the sadder part. Flooding. I need... um. If I just check the log. I haven't sold the steel this round. So I've never found a way to get steel. It'd be great if there was a way... But there's no ocean to place for steel at this point. No. So we'll still do um, Asteroid. It only costs us $2, but it gets us that heat bump, which gets us the heat income, and it gets us titanium back, which is fantastic, because now we have eight heat next round. So, you know, hitting our break points. Um, and I think we just need to keep, like I said, we have to plug away with that strategy of converting energy for TR. And getting more energy production because I'm not getting much heat production heat product like th there are a lot of heat bumps to buy maybe I'm just going to get standard technology at the end but even if I do I have seven income and very low TR throughout the whole game we're at gen 9 we are well well behind uh the mark on this this is a lot of TR so we'll grab it just because it might help us get where we need to go can we get three plant tags debatable I might grab plantation. It's a cheap, uh, a cheapo. All right. So plantation, I could just grab a steel with it. Honestly, turns out that's like one of the better strats. It's basically five bucks back for getting a TR. I hate, I hate that that's, like, the reality that I live in right now. Reducing my energy, buying up some card. Industrial Microbes is powerful, and it's a steal income, so it's basically $5 a turn and energy. It's going to be hard to dissuade me from that. can't believe I never got to play Electro Catapult because I never had the steal to go with it. That, like, is dumbfounding to me. But that's, you know, and now we have, like, we're going to have $30 worth of titanium next turn. So next turn, I'm going to buy Protected Valley. Yeah, okay. Because if I play Protected Valley, I'll have three plant tags, and then I can play the nitrogen-rich asteroid. Who knows? Maybe the game will be kind and give me uh, optimal arrow breaking, which is money and heat back on space events. That would be fantastic. Or even, like, Giant Ice Asteroid will do a lot of damage. 6% um, oxygen isn't going to happen, but bushes might. Fusion power might even, but, like, at that point, I'm like, bruh. If I need power, I already have tectonic stress. So, done. Let's sell the steel. Let's get the TR. And we do have Lake Marineris in hand, which is a really great way of getting oceans down. So we should really consider how we can get to that. We got Big Asteroid just now, which is like fantastic for us. We're finally getting like like some big space events that are going to move the needle, seeing as I'm sitting on so much titanium here. But that's great. Tons of titanium back. We then... Need another sign or plant tag as discussed. So let me protected valley. Um, I'm really not sure where is best. 
Maybe here. Just get the two plants and the opportunity to go in some weird places. Um, I could flood to lose a point, but that seems dumb. I just need to sell any card to be able to play the one I want to play. And I've got lots of cards to burn here, so. What do we got? Tardigrades is probably never going to be played. Uh, I'm never going to play you, Phobos Space Haven. If I did have too much titanium at the end of the game, I have tons of other point scoring cards that I would do. So there we go. And just like that, we have 37 TR going into Gen 11. So we need to get like, what, 13 TR per generation, the next two generations? Uh, yikes is the answer to that. We do not have the incomes to keep up with that. Even with the four plant income we just got, which is fantastic. Like, uh, I don't know, man. I do not. I don't, I don't feel so good, Mr. Stark. Uh, yeah, and we just played like literally 14 medals last round. 15 maybe. This card here would have given us $15. It did not happen. Solar wind power, I, I lean at. like I'm like, oh, bro, that's like basically three titanium to get two titanium back. But you got to buy the card, and it's a loss of titanium. And Okay. I can't do it. I need to just terraform. I need to just terraform. What are you doing, dummy? You got to terraform. We'll buy a card for two bucks because, like, you never know. But... Mm, no, it wasn't what we wanted. Um, okay, giant ice asteroid, I guess. This is going to get us so many plants. Let's just do down here. I know that, like, I could get more plants over here, but I was kind of a dummy and put my greenery here. On the wrong side of history. So now I need to, like, backfill this greenery land. It's fine, though. I thought for some reason that I might need another steel, but I did not. Now, I do. I cannot afford to screw up Colonizer Training Camp. We do not need to play... Like, I'm going to get to play... Oh, my God, English... Lake Marineris. I'm going to be able to play Lake Marineris. I don't need to play Futletting or Large Convoy because it's one more ocean here and then two oceans from Lake Marineris. Now, I do have... Wait, that's Tardigrades. Where is it? Oh, I thought I had... Oh, no, I could have bought the uh, Symbiotic Fungus or whatever, but I chose not to. All these great cards I have. And I grabbed SF Memorial thinking I would want to be like digging the deck early. We just didn't have that run, you know? We did not get that run. Bushes is really good though. It'll be like six plants for ten bucks, so I think I have to play bushes. Um I don't know that I even need tectonic stress power. I didn't get any of the cards that allow me to, like, burn energy for um, oxygen, which is what I was kind of hoping to keep the door open for, but really did not come, come down that way. I'm just selling cards that I know I don't want to play here, evaluating how much money we'll actually have. Because I might just want to buy... Well, I don't want to buy a greenery. I could buy two heat bumps. I think that would be best. Because we've already gotten pretty much all the best events um, for really cooking the planet. So a little bit of that is good for us. I can place this greenery safely, but if I place any more, I won't be able to play Colonizer Training Camp. As long as you know that, and I know that, we're both on the same page. You know what, I can play it now. Done. 
Now, the reason I thought that's important to play, I only have two Jovians. I was hoping that terraforming Ganymede would help more, but then I never got... I got a couple of expensive Jovians, and I mean, most Jovians are expensive, so, like, let's not be too upset about it. But, like, I never had, like, the surplus income to really chase Jovians like I thought I might at the start of the game. Hey, look, another points per Jovian. And a discount card? Like, oh my god. Not enough uh, space tags left, that's for sure. So, done. Get a little bit of TR. We need to get so much TR right now. We need to get up to 63 TR with $61. And I, um, I'm not help. I'm not hopeful. If I had a ton of Jovians, maybe. But, like, I do not. Um... This might end up getting us another greenery instead of going for the card. I'm not sure how. Yeah, okay. I am sure that it will because that did. So that's great. And then you do another one. You go for this card this time. We have all the oceans down. Another oxygen bump will get us uh, a heat bump. Uh, another oxygen bump will get us a heat bump. Is there anything that we want to put a greenery beside to get? I can't get two plants or anything. I could get, I could go here. Yeah, I guess I could just go for a card. I don't need steel. Like, I'm not playing any of the things I have. It's wild. So, like, greenery. I guess for a card. Just in case I get, like, a, a loan. <laughs> loan? Did not get a loan. Did get potentially a plant income. But yeah. E. I mean, the best chance I have of getting close is playing Terraforming Ganymede. Which I'll do. Um, I can't afford to play um, Water Import from Europa or anything first. So that gets us up to 60. And then, yeah, then I can sell 1, 2, 3, 4. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, eighteen bucks. You know, had I just gone for the center here, I could have maybe gotten a whole other greenery out of that. Um, but yeah, no, peat bump, and then I don't have enough plants. Honestly, it was a pretty bad run. I could have probably crushed as mining guild. Whatever, that's in the past. But the fact that we got 61 points or 61 TR is actually like... A little impressive to me compared to like we almost went five generations without any real income right we really were hoping for some sort of earth tag draw something to do with our titanium that maybe would have been good instead we were waiting on steel income for multiple cards and then we were kind of waiting on energy and then when we got the energy it was like well you know we can only trash energy so fast so now we need this other thing um Honestly, honestly, underwhelming game. Boo. Boo. But, uh, you know, that probably means I'll just do another one right after this. So you guys will definitely have another TM game in your near future. So, yay? Yay? <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Ciao for now.